If your wall mounted AC has a water leaking problem. So today, I will give you a detailed demonstration of the cause and how to fix it. Your air conditioner must be mounted on the wall, but I have placed mine on a table against the wall to show you how to fix the water in your AC. First of all, to avoid being electrocuted, shut off the breaker or plug installed with your air conditioning system. Now I have to open its hood from the top, which will look like this, as it is very easy to open. You have to open these screws, but be careful while doing it, as the swing of the AC is very fragile. Also, clean the filters of AC after every 15 days to not let the dust go inside the fins of the evaporator. Now let me show you the AC from the side, so what is the purpose of showing the AC from the side? The purpose is to make you understand this design. The evaporator of indoor is made in this design, which is a V-shape, and then it has straightened. And most air conditioners evaporator has this shape. This happens when the AC is working. The water is formed inside the evaporator fins due to condensation, which is easy to understand, the process of a substance changing from its gaseous state to its liquid state. This occurs when the temperature of a gas is lowered below its dew point, which is the temperature at which the vapor in the gas begins to condense into liquid droplets, the water travels in different areas of the AC. As the evaporator has a slope on the back and the front, the water will flow on both sides of the evaporator. Now let me tell you where the water is collected in the unit and where it exits from. This will make you understand how the water drain system works in wall AC and what causes the water to leak. Now I have removed the evaporator from the AC. You can only see the back side of the AC. You can see this one hole over here, and this is the water collector tray. The water from the evaporator flows here. And it has a hole on the other side. And water exits from this hole. With this hole, the water coming from the evaporator goes downward from here. The water collector tray has only one hole on the right side, and the water only exits from this hole on the right side, the area beneath the evaporator. This area also has a water collector tray. This is the water collector tray, which seems to be something like this. This water collector tray is installed something like this. This is the hole where the water exits. The drain pipe is also installed with a hole. As I told you before, the water that flows from the top tray also drains out from this hole. The hole which I showed you on the right side, the water flows on the back side then enters inside this another and towards the main tray through this hole. The back side of the AC has a water collection tray. They are made on a slope. And insulation is installed beneath to avoid moisture. The water from the right side of the back side will flow towards this hole. On the right side, a cover is installed above the motor used for water collection. The water will flow down from the evaporator in the tray. Then it will flow towards this hole and go out as drain water. Now let me tell you the mistake of why water leaks. This is when the drain hole is clogged with dirt. Open the drain clog by pouring water into the hole. If the problem still remains, we clean the evaporator. But as the AC is mounted on the wall, we don't clean it from the backside. You can see how badly the tray is clogged with dirt from the backside of the AC. As we filmed this clip at a customer's home who complained that his AC was not blowing air and water leaked in their AC, the water collector tray was clogged from the backside, which caused the water to leak. That is why after every two to three years, clean your AC by removing it from the wall. Now after cleaning the AC by removing it from the wall, you didn't take care of one other thing, still, the AC will leak water. That is, the insulation that covers the pipes is bad, and if it has not been changed, the AC will still leak water. Put in new insulation, then the problem will be fixed. Let me clear you one other thing as well. The water drain system of this AC is on the right side. If this hole is clogged with dirt, the water will fill in the tray and leak from the AC. If the drain pipe also gets blocked for any reason, it usually gets blocked from the joint. And the water will leak from this tray. This is also the reason if the AC is not cleaned for a long time. Other than this, if the AC is newly installed and it leaks water, then it will be the fault of the installation. The drain pipe is not properly joined or has been crooked, which has blocked the water from flowing. Now I have explained to you the complete system. It will be easier to fix this problem now in your AC and enjoy your time with AC. 
Click on the left or right thumbnail to watch our next videos. And subscribe. It's free. Thank you.